Hey guys, I got a question here in a PM, a person called Facecrawl that's wondering uh, if I'm gonna buy the PS Vita and what are my thoughts are about it. I think it looks great for a portable device, PS, I like your videos, and it's good that you make so much of them. Yeah, I, I also do believe so. Uh, but, uh, okay, so, uh, uh, am I gonna buy the PS Vita? It's a portable gaming device, it is the PSP successor, if you didn't know that already. Hmm, this is a very good question. This is a very good question. I mean, my my, hu my two huge interests has always been tech and, you know, games, of course, because I'm, I'm a man, you know, I'm, I'm a guy. So, of course, I'm gonna, like, you know, play games. I have a Let's Play channel, but, I, of course, I'm interested in new gadgets and technologies as well. And um, I, I'm one of those guys that's uh, been owning the Nintendo DS Lite, you know, I was playing it when I was 14. Then I also bought the PSP, uh, the PSP 3000, I think it was called. And uh, I played a lot on both of them, but I think uh, in the end I, and in the long run, I did enjoy my PSP more is because I played GTA Vice City, I think. Yeah, I think so. Uh, a lot on that device. And I was playing it so much. So, uh, you know, I was playing it like every single effing day for a couple of months, at least it feels like. And I love it so much. And then my PSP broke, you know, the controller started to get like kind of weird. So uh, I started like crying. No, I didn't. But uh, it was a sad moment. And I didn't return it to get a new one because I was a little kid and retarded. But you know that that was that was a magical game actually to play on that device. Uh, and I, I've always loved you know playing games like that. So uh, I might buy the PS Vita this summer, you know, because I'm gonna move this summer, and then I will be able to you know have a little more freedom. And also, I, I think I'm gonna plan to buy the. Xbox 360 because you know the new uh, Xbox 720 and like the PS4 it's gonna take a few years before those devices will be out in the market and I just wanna you know I love that console uh, gaming experience but I also love also that portable experience I don't uh, think that I would pick up the Nintendo 3DS just because I, I hate that 3D effect and uh, even though I, I like Mario games I probably rather pick up a Nintendo Wii but I'm, I'm kind of skeptical to that but if I would pick up a portable device this summer, I may pick up the PS Vita. Would be nice to make some, to you know do my own kind of unboxing and you know make my own kind of opinions about it. I think actually that the specs are kind of amazing. Uh, if you think that this device they did show it off like a year ago, uh, having this uh, Cortex A9 quad core uh, setup that we're now seeing on a lot of new uh, smartphones coming out. So I, I, I love the specs. I also love that it comes with two like joysticks. And uh, yeah, it would be fun to play a GTA game on that, but I'm not even sure, is it out for the PS Vita? I suppose it must be some kind of GTA game out for that, because I just love GTA, I just love those games. Um, yeah, I, I, I love it, it's uh, perfect, but uh, my main focus right now is going to be here, at least for a few months, going to be to continue to the videos on, on smartphones, try to get some of these new smartphones once they get out here on the market and then this summer I may start to you know buy some more consoles you know like the Xbox 360 uh, even though the Xbox 360 I know it's not a new device uh, okay the slim device may be a little, a little more fresh and you know like maybe buy uh, maybe buy that uh, Kinect I know it's out of a connect for PC right now, but I just love that console experience. Uh, so the PS Vita and Xbox 360 that may happen this summer, and that would be kind of nice, you know, have some fun, have some, have some gaming, maybe make more videos uh, for my Let's Play channel. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, see. You.